A hundred bagger is a stock whose market capitalization increases by at least a factor of 100 over a given period of time, so that one dollar invested would generate $100 or more in returns when the position was liquidated. In this video, we'll explore how to find such stocks. One of the most comprehensive studies of 100 baggers is the aptly titled book 100 Baggers, Stocks That Return 100 to 1 and How to Find Them by Christopher W. Mayer. In the book, Mayer notes that since 100 baggers must be capable of rising for years and years on end, they need the ability to avoid mean reversion. In other words, they must possess the ability to continually outperform and defend themselves from competitors. Mayer argues that companies with such moats, such sources of defensibility, may be hard to define based on their business attributes, but quantitatively, they are almost invariably characterized by high gross margins. Specifically, he writes, I'd sum up this way. It is great to have a moat, but true moats are rare and not so easy to identify all the time. Therefore, you should look for clear signs of moats in a business. If it's not clear, you probably are talking yourself into it. You may also want to find evidence of that moat in a firm's financial statements. Specifically, the higher the gross margin relative to the competitor, the better. Calculating gross margins is simple. Just take gross profit, or profit before overhead expense, and divide it by operating revenue. In addition to gross margin, 100 baggers tend to have noticeably superior returns on invested capital, meaning the companies are able to earn great profits on the capital they invest in their business. Charlie Munger, billionaire investor and business partner of Warren Buffett, stated thusly, Over the long term, it's hard for a stock to earn a much better return than the business which underlies it earns. If the business earns 6% on capital over 40 years, and you hold it for that 40 years, you're not going to make much different than a 6% return, even if you originally buy it at a huge discount. Conversely, if a business earns 18% on capital over 20 or 30 years, even if you pay an expensive looking price, you'll end up with one hell of a result. We can use the 6 Jupiter screener to find U.S. companies with outstanding gross margins and return on invested capital. For instance, we can start by filtering for companies with a return on invested capital of at least 13.32% and a gross margin of at least 81.1%. Such companies would be in the top 25% of exchange-traded U.S. companies by both those metrics at the time of this recording in November of 2017. In subsequent videos, we'll take a look at other tactics to find 100 baggers. To start your hunt for 100 baggers, subscribe at 6jupiter.com.